After the phone is powered down, the battery door can be removed to reveal the battery and the SIM or SD cards, which will need to be removed as well. The S3 had various models, so your repair may differ slightly from mine. Next, the 10 total Phillips screws in the back housing will need to be removed. While removing the screws, you may notice that a couple of them may not want to come out all the way. Using a thin opening tool to act as a lever as you unscrew it should help. Once all of the screws are out, a thin opening tool can be slid in between the back housing and the midframe of the phone from the battery bay. Twisting the tool around slightly inside of the housing should begin to unseat it enough that you should now be able to begin unclipping it from the outside. Now that the back housing is free, the loudspeaker and headphone assembly can be removed by first unclipping it from the phone and then prying it up in the same fashion as the back housing. Now the new loudspeaker assembly can be clipped back into the board as well as laid under the midframe. The back housing can then be applied, as well as the 10 screws that we removed earlier. Finally, any SD or SIM cards can be replaced, as well as the battery and battery door, finishing the repair.